term. Thanks so much for joining me. I received this today and I thought, oh, is it my Sarah Burns Craftamo box number one? Has it arrived? And I looked at it and I thought, oh, that's not very exciting. It's just a plain brown box. Then I opened because I thought perhaps it was something else. And then inside is a lovely artwork box. So you can see that it is pretty. I thought I would do an unboxing with you guys, but before I open it, I thought it would be interesting to compare the size of the Emma Lefebvre boxes with this one. So it's quite a lot smaller. Um, be interesting to see what the contents inside are like. So let me remove the plastic. So there we are, I've taken the plastic off and let's see what we have inside. It's a very pretty artwork over here. Beautiful sea. So this is going to be a gouache painting experience, which I am sort of excited and worried about. Um, and you get a syrup. Sarah HX Croftimo or something. Um, and then much like in the Emma boxes, we got we're getting a little artwork which I think is awesome, signed by Sarah Burns. And then there's the link which I'm covering, which is to give the class, and then it says featuring Shinhan art. So I'm excited for that. And then inside we have some painter's tape, which I'm always pleased about. Some branded Sarah Burns brushes. They're lovely, they're very pretty. So this is a half inch flat and a lovely 12 round. Sarah Burns Craftamo brushes. Then we have, just throwing that in the trash, some gouache paint, primary white, ultramarine deep, lemon yellow and quinacridone red. So we've got the primary colors, which is fantastic. I have very little gouache, so that was one of the reasons I decided to go for this box. And they are quite big tubes. I've also, in my research, learned that gouache is best in a tube because it dries out quite a lot. So that's those. Then a lot of stuff. And then a little spray bottle. And a very cute plastic cover with something in it. Oh, this is a, a see-through palette. I don't know if you can even see it, but it's going to be for mixing. Um, and then I'm not sure what this is. I will do the class and discover later on what that is. <laughs> and I'm going to post this with just as an unboxing not with me doing, sorry, I can't speak and do things at once. Not with me doing an artwork right now because I'm not really very good with gouache, so I'm not ready to do it yet. Um, and then the other thing in this box is some 100% cotton paper. And this is also half the size of what the Emma Lefebvre paper was. And we used to get five sheets of double this. So in here there are one, two, one, two, three, four. So fewer sheets of paper, um, half the size, which is a bit of a disappointment to me because I actually really like this paper. I'll put it away just now. But I think it's an exciting box and that's a lot of paint and it's quite expensive paint. So. I'm excited about that and some lovely brushes. So I hope you've enjoyed seeing this unboxing with me and I hope to see you again soon. Bye bye for now.